don't get me wrong, but uh, I do want to see an RTX video card with this kind of system. You know, it's kind of weird, you know, but uh, it may happen sometimes, you know. I will 100% sure I will put, put an SSD, um, a better SSD for this i7 and put Windows 10 or Windows 11 or whatever. But um, yeah, this is the system that I'm using for um, SLI and Crossfire and hence why I wanted to see how this i7 is working with this 3080. I already tried a couple of games and I will show you there is a couple of problems. For instance, um, apparently even on Twitter showed uh, Fortnite. I'm getting uh, I'm getting ahead of the problem. I want to see if I can find a couple of games that I actually uh, get bottlenecked, if I can say that. Okay, so managed to set up the game for video maximum details and uncapped it's like there is no way you, you cannot use the game with this rtx 38 4 2 yes 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 well done deep prince ah oh, it doesn't matter it doesn't matter the whole point of this game was to actually see if we can uh, manage to load the GPU, but nada, nada. The GPU doesn't feel nothing. Even the CPU is doing a fantastic job. Oh, it's a good combination. Ruthless. Oh yeah. I'm not gonna say no. To four goals. DirectX 11, FXA, let's load the whole goddamn GPU, seriously, to its misery. Ultra, ultra, everything is maximum aside from motion blur. 50% load on the CPU and nearly 50% load on the GPU. It's like it's well balanced, the 3080 RTX with an i7 4 gen. Oh, come on, man. Come on. This is the most hilarious combination ever seriously oh yeah i was so close 2.5 i want to see how far this is gonna work wow 30 frames what the frack man i managed to bottleneck the gpu <laughs> 2.5 yeah about two percent two by one yeah, 9497, we got 60 FPS. Let's drop your filter 16 view distance maximum. We're gonna brutalize the video card. 40%, 40, 60 the GPU. Oh my god. Spectacular. This is gorgeous. This is exactly what I want. Okay, not this. Are you telling me it doesn't flip back? Freaking fantastic! I love how the CPU is holding. Listen, let's have a chat, yeah? Let, let's agree to disagree that because I have a great experience with my CPU and my GPU. I don't want you to ruin it. I cannot ask more from a CPU like this with the RTX 30. It's not ideal for this CPU, you know? I, I want better experience. It doesn't matter. It does the job. 50-60%. It's nearly cooling it perfectly, but... Shaders quality, maximum field of view. Oh my god, when was the last time I played Paladins with the maximum details? It doesn't make any sense. I'm actually mesmerized how this system is working, seriously. I'm not gonna lie, this is insane. You 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 know that we did we need uh, we did that as a as a challenge to to see how this i7 is working. Dude, this combination is it's it's crucial, you know, for my knowledge. <laughs> to know that this to know that this i7 can actually do the job with the um, RTX 3080. Nah, it's 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 fantastic. Nothing. What do you have? Ah. Triple kill. Enemy triple kill. 
Damn. Okay, so, what I'm talking about is maximum details. And I'm, aside from motion blur, I don't want motion blur, I hate it. He said, Dan, your CPU is 4790 stock, not K. The K version, actually the S version, it's in the streaming machine that is streaming this. Yeah. So I have two i7s, this, and an S. That's it. What do you think about the performance? Hey, look at it. 50-50. It's like this i7 is insane. If you're not playing some idiotic game, you know, that uses an i9. This is so cool. I never knew. I, I never knew. If I didn't put this in the system, I would have never believed you. If you would have told me that this is the performance I would get with a 3080 RTX with an i7 4th gen, nah, I would have not even close. Seriously, not even What's settings. Alright, graphics. Yeah, ultra. There is nothing we can do more, yeah? The whole point is to find some games that is uh, not very well suited, you know? I want to this, this configuration, i7 4th gen and RTX 38, yeah? But apparently they work. That's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it, that's it. Almost, almost hit him. Should push you on the other side, seriously. to spawn you on. Oh, he managed to... Lap 3 out of 3. No, don't, 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 don't. Where's then? Quality, preset, ultra setting, we sync off. Stretching on advanced graphics. Yes, we want. Ultra high. This is it? This is the game that managed to load the CPU so much that the C the C man this is the game that loads the CPU and makes the uh, makes the GPU kind of useless. GPU load seventy percent isn't useless. Yeah, but, uh, uh, this is the first time I'm actually looking at a game that says uh, you're nearly there, you know? So, yeah, you have to find a new, new CPU in the near future. Holy freaking sh**. The GPU will be bottleneck in this game. The GPU will be bottleneck in this game on maximum details with that i7 4th generation. Not even a K model, yes? i7 4790, non-K. Fantastic, seriously, fantastic. Actually, both of the CPU and GPU, yeah. Oh yeah. It's exactly like in GTA 5 with... Yes, fantastic. Okay, so... Uh, system... Graphics... Uh, uh -huh, advanced... No, fun. very high. We uh, are in this for a run. Yeah? yeah? You have the FPS. The GPU is not fully loaded. The CPU is not fully loaded. Yeah? This is hilarious, man. This is really hilarious. Because every single time I'm trying to this the CPU, the CPU managed to surprise me. You understand? In GTA 5, we did fantastic. The only game was what? Assassin's Creed. But it, here in Crisis, look, it's doing fantastic. You know, baby. It's not fair because this is a very old game. What is 2009? But I do want to find the difference between them, you know. And I have a question, where is this car going, you know, so... 
imagine having an RTX 3080 and the sing single handle you be bottleneck you be bottlenecked by this GPU seriously yeah, I can't believe it I don't believe it look at it look at it yeah look at it 80 percent listen 80 percent the code load on the RTX 3080 yes on maximum details in the in crisis 3 yeah it's using only 1.7 gig of VRAM 70 percent nothing yes to how much power it needs to process this video card you understand imagine the quality of the game imagine how this is it's insane man insane insane crisis history yeah the cpu has nothing 30 40 percent nah nada the system ram 4.3 gig right how are we doing 70 80 percent load on the cpu actually this is a cpu game for the first time i'm actually finding a proper game that says you know what you need a better cpu fam because the gpu that you have it doesn't doesn't uh how should i say it doesn't stress wow that was disgusting all right I'm actually surprised how the the whole system is working though it needs more cpu doesn't matter we are very satisfied about this combination did i do the last kill holy mother of sweet baby jesus Dude, you think it's not worth it? It's worth it. You seen it? He barely managed to find two games that actually be, uh, how should I say, uh, be bottlenecked by this i7. Fantastic. Well, maybe with Windows 10 it will be totally different. Who knows?